Welcome back, baseball fans, to the 6972 Carryover League. We have our final interleague series for the All Star break. We're out west, third place teams a year ago Seattle at Houston. Game one in Seattle, Larry Durker uh, beat Skip Lockwood, and they are up one zip in the best of three. They're home. They like to win this thing two straight in the dome. We'll have one of the best records in baseball. They've been one of the surprise stories in the league. But, unfortunately, the Dodgers are just as good, it seems. Uh, the Mariners are 12-12. and 12. That's a celebration. That's a parade. Uh, that's fantastic for a super expansion team. And there's still just three games out of first. Uh, this is a pretty competitive division. Uh, but, look at the National League West. Dodgers and Astros are playing a different brand of baseball. Disappointing Giants, and of course the Padres are there as well. Uh, Astros could go a half game up on the Dodgers uh, if they win this series. So, let's get started. For your Mariners, Luke Walker steps to the mound. And for Houston, Denny LeMaster. Battle of lefties from the Astrodome. Let's get started. Dale Maxville. 111, bounce to second. Ron Woods, 35, is a single. John Ellis, 111, 5, 4, 3, double play. Joe Morgan leads off. 4-4, four, four, off the Walker card. Triple 1 to 8 is a single. He, he's a double-A stealer. He'll take off, and he steals second. As uh, Jim Price has only a zero arm. Dennis Mankey, 212, grounds a third. A double play there. Sedanio, 67 to K. And the Toy Cannon, Jim wins. Guys to center with two outs. Wow. Kurt Moten, 6'11. Bounce it at first. This is Watson at first. He's a 4E13 at first in the dome, and he makes the play. Joe Pepitone, 65. Triple one of three, double off of the MasterCard. He'll stand up at second with a double. Rich Rennick, 49. Pops a short. With two outs, it's Jim Price, 37. The Whiff. Bottom of two. Doug Raider really crushes lefties. 37. Let's take a look at the Raider card. Definitely a dis, uh, an imbalance here. Crushes lefties. 3-7 is a single. Lead off the inning. Bob Watson. 2-8. Let's look at him now. Triple 1 of 13. Double off the Watson's card. That's a triple, a run. And the Astros are 21 outs away from a sweep. Uh, they'll bring it up for Jose Cruz. 2-5 first. Still up for Marty Martinez, 2-8, pop out. That with two outs. Jose Martinez, 43, flies the left X. Moten, that was a 43 at, in left field, and he plays that ball into a triple, unfortunately. Had probably never been in the eighth wonder of the world, I'm guessing. Uh, runner at third, two outs for Joe Morgan. 39's a walk. Runs in the corners for Mankey, 43, left X, and here's Motten again. But he comes down with this one. He figured it out after that last uh, mistake. Two nothing throws in the third. Ulander, 34, pitcher. Jerry Adair, double one of three, a single. Dale Maxville, left. Ron Woods, 39's a walk, two on, two outs for John Ellis. 1-6, take a look at John Ellis' card. Uh, not good defensively, but a big bat. Was always able to hit lefties and righties. Uh, not much defense. 1-6, homer, 1-9, double, and that is gone. A two-out, three-run homer, and Seatle takes the lead. Kurt Moten walks. Joe Pepitone, 38 singles. What's going on with LeMaster here in the fourth? Rennick, 35, flies a left. 3-2, Mariners. Sedania, 1-4, left. Jimmy Wynn, the toy cannon, 34, left. And Doug Rader, 2-11, bounces a short. We'll go to the fourth inning. It's Jim Price, 30, 38, is the sky to center. Ulander, sky to center. Jerry Adair, pops to second. Bottom of the fourth. Three to two. Bob Watson, 5'10. Catcher's card. Price is a. Uh, oh, he's a 3 to 16. Good chance of getting an error here. But not 
So, Joe Cruz, 32, Lomax, and with two outs, Marty Martinez, bounce to short. Luke Walker, shake it early and settle down. Three to two, Maxville, one seven is a base hit. Ron Woods, 56 is a K. John Ellis, two five, a six four, three double play this time. We go to the bottom of the fifth, but before that, let's take a moment with a word from our sponsor. This is the Shrimp Trawler video channel. Este es el canal de videos de camaroneros. Bottom of the fifth, Jose Martinez and the Astros, 310. Base hit, tie runs aboard. Joe Morgan, 47, sink one to four. He gets the single one to four on the roll of a four. Tough break for Luke Walker there, two on. For Dennis Menke, 6'10", third X. Rennick is awful. He is, yeah. He's a 40-37 at third base. Ground ball C, he'll take it. That puts both runners in scoring position for Sedano. Bring it up with a one-run lead. 1-7, one, doesn't matter. Let's look at Sedano's card. Came up uh, with a 70 card last year, but then we bumped it up to the 72 card because this is pretty much Cesar at the height of his powers. You know, a very young Cesar, but still. One of his best years in his career. 1-7, double to center field. That will be a two-out, a one-out double. Scoring both runners. Jim Wynn, 48. Walks. Two on, one out for Radar. 67 Ks, and with two outs. Watson Ks. All right, Strohs retake the lead, four to three in the six. Kurt Monton, 58. This guy's left. Pepitone, two eight, it's a single. Rennick, one eight, is another single to left. Pepitone will hold its second base. Two on, one out for Price. 46 is a sky to center. And with two outs, it's Hugh Lander, 63. Pitcher X, he's an E0. There you go. Bottom of the sixth inning. Luke Walker, down by a run, 4 to 3. Joe Cruz, rounds the first. Marty Martinez, K's. Jose Martinez, bounces it to second base. We'll go to the seventh inning. Is there some defense we could bring in? Well, we could bring in a decent first baseman. And yeah, Tom McCraw will come in and play first base where, where Marty Martinez was. Actually, where Jose Martinez was. All right, we go to the seventh inning, 4-3. Jerry Adair. 45, center. Dale Maxvale, 58, left. And Ron Wood, 64. He doesn't have power. Look at that. Homer, 1 to 15 off the pitcher. He ends up with, on second base. Ellis with two outs. He's got all three of the runs attributed to him. Bounces to first. The inning's over. Stretch time in Houston with a 4 3 lead for the hometown Strohs. We're listening to 13th Floor Elevators. I think it's their debut record. I don't know what the year it was on this. They didn't put it here. Probably 67, I want to guess. Anyhow, bottom of seven. Luke Walker still pitching. Joe Morgan, 67, is the line out to third. Dennis Mankey, 52, center. Cesar Sardinia, 57, is a K. People have been watching these Seattle games and expecting, you know, a blowout. Forget it. Seattle's been playing tough all year with a completely overmatched roster. And they're down a run going into the last six outs. LeMaster's a star of seven, but he was an all-star a year ago. So he will continue. And it'll be Kurt Moten. 6'11". First X, the new first baseman we just brought in for defense. Tom McCraw, a 2 -E 22 at first base. And he makes the play on the Exion. Interesting. Joe Pepitone, 35, single one to eight. Lines out. Two outs, it's Rennick, 42. Flies to right field. All right, bottom of the eighth. We're going to pull Walker. 
with some righties coming up and Dave Rader being one of them. We'll go Diego Segui in the eighth. Here's Diego. So the Toy Cannon leads off the eighth inning with a one run lead. Three, six, Toy Cannon, let's take it. Let's take a look at the card. Oh my goodness, folks. Just prodigious. 148 walks this season. Unbelievable. And 33 home runs. And a 269 average. We have an insurance run. It's 5-3 Astros. Drader, Doug Rader, 59, second X. Adair's a 3-E-13 at second base. Oh, a cheap single up, Jerry Adair. It's all coming apart here for the Mariners late in the game. Watson, 67 is a K. Joe Cruz, 1 8, triple 1 4 is a single at that. Runners on the corners are going to bring it up for Marty Martinez. And the pitch, 1 5. Let's take a look at Marty Martinez. 1 5, triple 1 to 17. Misses it. Gets the single dot dot. We got a 6 3 game. I've been holding one out for Tom McCraw. 4 11, right X. Ron Woods a 2 8 in right field. And no sack fly. Oops. With two outs now, it's Joe Morgan. 3 6 is the sky to center. So, LeMaster. He's going to turn it over to their closer. A little disappointed not to finish the game, but uh, the Astro reliever could use some work, and that's Jim Ray. Uh, 211 ERA in 98 innings in 1971. Jim Ray will get a chance for a save. It'll be Price, Ulander, Adair. Doesn't look good for the Mariners. Jim Price, 45, is a double off the Jim Ray card. Ted Ulander, 47, is a K. Jerry Adair, 58, flies to left. And with two outs, it's all up to Maxvale, or we'll have a Houston sweep. 49 is a walk. Two on, two outs. Ron Woods doesn't have power. Does anybody on this team have power or have the ability to hit a home run here to in a big spot. Well, here's the here's the problem. If you bring a left-handed here, they're in. They'll bring in Ron Cook, and the game's over. So Ron Woods will bat here. The pitch to Ron Woods, 56 off the pitcher's card. Anyway, is a ground to the short. He's a three at shortstop, a three e40 at short, and he boots the ball. We got a ball game here. Now you got the bases loaded now with two outs, and it's the dangerous John Ellis with a three-run homer earlier. The chance to follow this up in the ninth with a grand salami and a seven-six comeback. And don't sell it, don't let, scoff at this. The Mariners have done stuff like this earlier in the year. John Ellis, Jim Ray, the pitch, sixty-seven off of the Ray card is a strikeout. Mariners come up short, but you like you like their resilience. They play solid baseball all year long. Hovering around 500. Jim Ray does get a shaky save for the Strohs. He got up a hit, a walk, and a K, and a, hit a walk in two Ks and a ninth. Eight strong innings for LeMaster. Nine hits and three runs and three run homer early. That was it. Two walks and two strikeouts. Diego Segui did not help the cause. He uh, came in and gave up four hits, two runs, and a K. Tough loss for Luke Walker. Seven hits and four runs. They were all earned. Two walks and five strikeouts. 1019 0108 611 310 to 3426. So let's put the composite box for both squads. Astros. They're the darlings now in the National League. They are overachieving. 
at a time in their era where they just weren't ready yet. The Colt 45 transition. Joe Morgan's still there. He'll be there for a couple more years before he goes to the Reds. Maybe that'll be the difference. Um, year to date, the Astros now find themselves at 15 and 8. They've only lost one series thus far. Amazing. 15 and 8. Hitting 269 with a 323 ERA. And the Mariners, look, they have nothing at all to be ashamed of. They've played great baseball, and a lot of it too. Uh, 25 baseball games. They have a chance to com com uh, compete for the Commissioner Award, which we spoke of earlier, for roster utilization. They're hitting 228 with a 407 ERA. And year to date, we've played 301 games, and the league is hitting 261 with a 395 ERA. That's it today from Houston. Congratulations, Astros, on a two game sweep. Thanks for checking out the video. We'll see you next time.